Welcome back, Divi friends, to another project update for October 19th, 2022. It is hump day, my dudes. That's right. It's Wednesday. Hope you guys are enjoying your day. It's kind of hot where I am right now, so I hope you guys are having a little bit cooler weather. But yeah, let's go over the Divi news. What's going on today with the Divi project? We'll get a little backstage update on what's going on in Madrid. But to start off, though, let's uh, let's set our reminders for this Friday at 2 p.m. Eastern, 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time for this week's Divi Community Spaces. So again, set that reminder and bring a friend in. Boom, there we go. I'm reminder set. It's going to be exciting. Life comes at you. Huh? We're going to be talking about lightning works. Who knows? But yeah, it's always great to hang out with the Divi community. We can chat about Divi, La Liga, DeFi, and whatever's on your mind, really. Like, it's a community discussion, so pop on in. Sometimes we get the CEO popping in. Sometimes we get the CMO. Like you never know who comes into these discussions, but they're always great to be a part of. So again, that's this Friday. Now, what else is going on with Divi Project? We also got a new episode of the Divi Crypto Podcast. This is episode 176. Our host, Stephen McGeary, is joined by Gandalf De Brown, the founder and CEO of Hashflow, to discuss making trading easier. So you can listen to this on Spotify or Apple Podcasts. They're always great listens, like you don't want to miss out. You could be missing out on some great inside info. Uh, RP on the Discord was like, did anyone listen to the podcast with Justin Bannon from Bonson Protocol on the Divi Crypto podcast? Pretty exciting stuff. So yeah, guys, do not miss out on these podcasts. Uh, the links are always on Twitter or they're on the Discord channel. Yes, if you're not part of the Divi Discord, join it because <laughs> you can ask your questions. Nick, Knees, anybody will pop in and answer some questions for you. So yes, so be sure to listen to that. All right, now let's go over the backstage events. What's happening right now with the Divi team in El, I was gonna say El Salvador, <laughs> in Madrid, Spain. Divi Project was like, hey, Divi Wallet, what's the plan for today? Any special challenges for Girl Gone Crypto? Well, let's take a look. The Divi Wallet team and Girl Gone Crypto planning the week in Madrid. Here's a little short. <laughs> She's with Renuk, and I'm not sure where the other girl is. So yeah, that was just her and Renuk. Nice chill beat music. And then we also got another one. How about a sneak peek of some behind-the-scenes footage with Girl Gone Crypto and Nick Sapinera at the La Liga headquarters. Give us a like if you're excited about this content. So here we go. This is the La Liga headquarters. And ooh. Are we going to get an interview from Girl Gone Crypto and Nick Sapinero? Mm-hmm. We just got to wait and find out. That's That little clip right there kind of gave me some hope for that. So I look forward to that interview between these two. It's going to be awesome. And let's get some more behind the scenes on the Instagram channel. Uh, here's Sophie Chambers' point of view. Look at that. We're at the La Liga, hanging out with the La Liga headquarters today. So that's where all of them are at. Then let's look over at Mr. Delibano Shorts. I think he is like the photographer. Again, there's the team from yesterday. <laughs> yep, the photographer. Can't forget about him. <laughs> and then there was the team from yesterday enjoying it. The team, Girl Gone Crypto. And again, who is she again? Do you guys know? She's just a friend of Girl Gone Crypto who got to enjoy the experience with her. Maybe. And lastly, planning the day ahead with this spot brecky. So you guys are still there, just planning their trip. But yeah, so that's what's going on in Madrid, Spain. So looking forward to the interview with Girl Gone Crypto and Nick. And then what else is Girl Gone Crypto talking about on Instagram or Twitter? It's always good to follow her too. She still posts great content. Uh, let's see. She's like, what's something you're grateful for? Uh, reposting the photo. I like, I like this question down here, though, that she did. Spoiler alert. Things don't end well for fiat currencies. I hope you guys understand that. And that's why we are in cryptocurrencies. So, yes, things are not looking good. Uh, Nikki Sapinera even was talking about the just in Japan to allow crypto exchanges to list coins without screening process, says Bloomberg. But, yeah, every jurisdiction is fighting to become a crypto hub except the U.S. Yes, the U.S. is just lagging, lagging. And it's not going to do well in the long run. So that's why you see all these projects moving to other countries because there's regulations everywhere going on already. And take advantage of it because right now it's not going to happen in your area unless you want to make a change. So, yeah, so that's what's going on there. And then what else is going on in the Divi news? But when Moon was like, go vote, get Divi project, $1 million in a funding grant. I did a how-to video on how to vote for this project. Very simple to do. Uh, if you don't want to go through the read-through of it, the how-to process starts at the 3 minute and 36 second mark where you're signed up for pre-search. If you don't want to 
uh, get the PRE tokens for the 10x multiplier, then just bump up to the 615 mark, which is going straight into the deposit. Oh, wait, never mind. Go to the eight minute mark, and that will take you to the voting for Divi project. But yeah, if you want a 10x multiplier, I go through Uniswap to get the pre token. I deposit into my address on the pre search, and boom, it's very simple to do. So I'll leave a link again for this one down below so that way you guys can know how to do it. This event goes on until December 16th. Vote for Divi for that 100 grand. A lot of, thank, a lot of guys are appreciating the video. Canon Killer, thanks for the walkthrough. This was really helpful. Love it. I think there was another one who had doubts about how to vote, and you solved them. Thank you. You're welcome, guys. Like, I did this so you guys could see how easy it was. Nothing really to be afraid of or the doubts. So, yes, I hope this video helped you. Again, links will be down below, and this contest goes on until December 16th. And let's see, Lightning Works has some news. Did you know that if you mint a Lightning Works portal 777 on November 7th, that you're able to mint an NFT from our general collection for free? That's right, two for one. So I cannot wait for these comics to come out and mint one of those comic books. I got my portal pass. If you still need one, there are chances out there. Here's a little inside story of Lightning Works and one of the characters from their comics. Sold into slavery by his own mother, Flama is out for revenge and will raise hell on anyone that gets in his way. Like, comment, retweet if you're turning her into triumph for a chance at a portal access pass. So yes, like, comment, and retweet this if you want to. But this is one of the characters in their comics they're creating, and it looks very exciting. Uh, also, like, if you want to learn more about it, check out Lightningworks.io. There is a link down below for that, where you can learn about legendary stories told through interactive comics, NFTs, and Web3 gaming. That's right, they have a first-person shooter game called Siege Worlds, so you can earn some divvy by playing this game. I joined a squad because I think Millennium Sound is looking for one. Yes, Divi up for grabs, going live. The game gives away crypto just for playing. That's right. So, yeah, look into Lightning Works. They're a big thing and a part of Divi. But that's about it for this Divi project update. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Price of Divi is at 0.0158 cents. We're up 3.72% since yesterday. Market cap's at $49.4 million and trading volumes at 171000 Market cap for link is number 363, and then here's our day chart. We've just been bouncing up and down, but going sideways. Total master, node out, master nodes out there is 2,073, so very nice. And again, if you haven't downloaded the official regional crypto wall of the Liga, the link is down below for this website where you can get it from the Apple Store or Google Play. And as always, guys, don't forget to hit that thumbs up on your way out, subscribe to the channel, and until next time, the Crypto Sherpa is out.